desktoping Rubicon model can be had for $36,995. The 2018 Jeep Wrangler's debut at the Los Angeles Auto Show gave us reason to be excited for the future of the iconic off-roader. Alongside an updated new look, the Wrangler came equipped with additional features, both inside and out, and a weight loss treatment of nearly 200 pounds (90 kilograms), thanks to the extensive use of aluminum. No, we know know how much all those new features will cost. The Wrangler JL will start at $26,995 for the two-door sport model, and $36,995 for the two-door Rubicon. Both examples come standard with an updated 3.6-liter Pentastar V6. The four-door model will force you to dish out a bit more cash, naturally, the base unlimited sport starts at $30,495. The next up Sahara starts at $37,345, and the range topping Rubicon comes in at $40,495, not including a $1,195 destination charge. For what it's worth, the base sport model comes with standard features like a 6-speed manual gearbox, 8-speed automatic is optional on all trims, Dana 30 and 35 solid front and rear axles, a transfer case, and 17-inch all-season Bridgestone tires. If you want standard features like 17-inch BF Goodrich off-road tires, automatic headlamps, and more USB ports in the cabin, one up front and one in the rear, you'll have to opt for the range-topping Rubicon model. Optional features like a tow hitch, a three-piece modular hardtop roof, and Mopar slush mats can be added to any trim, as can the new 2.0-liter turbocharged engine beginning in spring. As we've seen in other vehicles recently, that is, Ford Mustang, the 3.6-liter V6 will act as the entry-level power unit, while the turbocharged 2.0-liter will be the range-topping version for now. The new Jeep Wrangler will go on sale in January of 2018 equipped with the standard V6, while the turbocharged four-cylinder will join the range early in Q1. A diesel unit will be available beginning in 2019, and a plug-in hybrid model has been confirmed for 2020.